So I'm going to show you today how we build out these um, stats graphs. So if you go, here's an example of one on a site we're working on, hobokennj.com. Uh, you can see you can scroll down to these new construction buildings. And if we hit Hudson T, for example, it pulls up the page. And it's got a little graph showing all the properties and some information there. I'm going to just show you on this kind of loads up there. It shows a little boingy thing there. This is kind of below the fold and you can move it up. So what we're going to talk about today is how to build these uh, graphs. So this is part of our IDX add-ons package and there's a tool for it. So we're going to go to littlerockishome.com and set this up and show you how it works. Okay, so um, we do need to in install a plugin here. It's called AMR shortcode. So we're going to install that and activate it. Okay. What that'll do is it allow us to put a shortcode for any widget, and I'll show you where that's going to be important here uh, in a little bit. Need to um, add our plugin to here. Okay, so we've got the plugin here. We'll install it. Okay, so we've got both those plugins. And now what we'll do is we'll uh, add a new community. And we'll call it Chanel 2. Let's just save that as a draft for right now because I'm actually going to go get a. Uh, uh, I need to know what the saved search is. So basically, all you need is these saved searches. This is the one we want. So this is just an IDX broker um, save search that's already been created for this neighborhood. Edit this. And down here, this is we're only going to show single family homes in this case, but if we wanted to, we could also put um, multi family and maybe we can put commercial. And I don't know what really is available in that area. So let's publish this page. Maybe we could put here some information about Chanel. And then what we'll do is um, go here to widgets. Okay, so here's the widgets for short codes. So what we'll do is we'll come over here to IDX add-ons community. We'll pop it in here. And we'll call this one Chanel Market Stats. Then you can go in and change all these colors so they match your theme correctly. And um, we'll just save this. Okay, and then we'll come here. We're going to use this community, Chanel 2, because it has the right thing. And then we'll grab the short code. Okay, so let's save that. 
and then we'll go back. I'm actually going to open this in a, in a new window. And then I guess below that information, let's say that we're going to put in our stat chart. Okay, so let's uh, click that open and see what it looks like. And you can see there's Chanel, it's got 93 units. Looks like they're all residential. And the average price is this, homes listed over that. So now what you would need to do is go in there and uh, change, the, uh, change the styling on it so it matches a little bit better to the site. And you're all hooked up. And that's how, uh, how the tool works. It's super easy to set up and it'll work uh, using any IDX broker account on any server. Check it out at uh, realtycandy.com. Look up at the top where it says IDX add-ons.